Every time I close my eyes, I see myself on the throne already, with my subjects bowing down before me. I know you never liked his majesty, you wanted him dead, but I will tell you that I know when they get back to you in this palace. And you were just a maid that fought her way to royalty. You are crossing the boundary, and what boundaries are you talking about? You should be ashamed of yourself. You came here to ridicule our father. You are mad. You are stupid. You are mad. You have gone bonkers. I tell you, mock me. What is there to just kill an imbecile? What is there? You should hide your face in the mud, sleeping with your own blood brother. What are you going to teach your children when you eventually get married? I'm going to tell my unborn children that I, Turugo, enjoyed life to the fullest. Tell your God that you are not welcome into this palace. You can't exempt me from the palace. I dare you! I dare you too! Are you not? You are all foolish! There will be real war in this palace. I'm going to unleash the tigress in me. That imbecile, he can't even sit on the throne. He's useless. You have to kill him so that I become king. You will be the next Igwe of this kingdom. I am not interested in any throne. He can never be the king. I have condoned enough of your excesses in this palace. This is my house, my home, my palace, my kingdom, my empire. I can see you are ready for trouble. I am the first son of this king I am here. Tell him to unfreeze the royal account. Have I not freeze the family's account? It is 50% share of our father's income. Nothing more, nothing less. Abana, you lie! I need full access to my father's money. I have said my word and it is final. You write the bishop. Tell him to give me back my property. Igwe is the second of Asia Moku Kingdom has just joined his ancestors. Ah! His Majesty is alive. You want me to return to Jamike and have him kill me for the third time? No! I speak! I speak well! Because I am here!